Welcome back to Celebrity News where we give you the ride update and all of what you would like to know. So if you're new here or if at all you're just passing by for the first time, please take some minutes of your time to subscribe, like, comment and hit the notification button so that you don't miss in any of my uploads. The Canny West Academy has been sued by former officials, alleging wrongful termination and unsafe conditions. A fourth former director of the Canny West-founded Christian Music Academy and School is suing, alleging he was improperly fired after he complained about unsafe conditions. The lawsuit, filed in Los Angeles County Superior Court last week, accuses the Academy of having poor plumbing and electrical problems, as well as windows and skylights without glass, because West, who also calls ye, doesn't like glasses, NBC News reported. Isaiah Meadows, former deputy principal of Yeezy Christian Academy The School, later known as Donda Academy announced that he had been suspended and fired after he complained about the school's allegedly harmful condition. Meadows, who was first named vice principal in 2020, claims he was promised housing assistance so he could buy a home closer to the school, but it never delivered, forcing him to pay tens of thousands of dollars. The Meadows website reported that the classroom windows had no glass in the skylight because Wes did not want glass, and as a result, water leaked into the classroom. The suit says bad wiring at the academy caused an electrical fire near the cafeteria. He also claims that the septic tank has some problems, so it overflows frequently. What is happening at this school is extremely serious, said Ron Zambrano, the attorney representing Meadows and the other plaintiffs. The illegal and vindictive behavior of Mr. West and the school administrators has been on record over and over by other former employees who never work together, but they are all under scrutiny. The same treatment. And witness the same egregious violations of health, safety and education law. Well they all suffer the same fate unfair dismissal and we intend to hold them accountable. Although the school later moved to Donda Academy and changed locations, Meadows alleged in his lawsuit that many problems with school continued. As for his complaints about the school, Meadows claims he was retaliated against and not paid adequately. And in August 2022, about 14 days before the school's fall semester, Meadows announced that he had been fired indefinitely. Another lawsuit was filed this year through the same law firm after two former teachers brought charges against West and Donda for wrongful termination. The two teachers accused the school of a lack of medical staff or maintenance, rampant bullying, as well as several rules that appeared to prohibit the use of forks and clothing that was not black or designed by ye. A third plaintiff was added to the lawsuit last month, according to a previous report by NBC News ye, whose attorney Gregory Sower denied the allegations in court filings, saying that the allegations caused Donda Academy's current staff, students and parents who will testify, not to benefit from their positive experience. Donda Academy is said to be closed in 2022, following a series of controversial comments by Yi of an anti-Semitic nature. School officials said they plan to reopen the academy in September and are accepting applications for the 2023-2024 academic year. Thanks for watching to the end, and guys don't forget to subscribe like this video, share and leave your comment on the comment section below your comments, matters see you next time.